TFNN Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. As we reach the afternoon and quiet a day it's been in the market so far, we got a little trade concern this afternoon, sending markets to negative territory. Right now, you have the Dow off 199 points, trading 27,734. S&P's negative by 20 points, right at 3,100, trading at 3,100.49. NASDAQ right now, negative 71 points. That's off a solid 8 tenths of percent, trading 84.99. And the Russell, negative by 13 points, trading at 15.85. As we have markets on trade worries, the news breaking, we may not get a phase one trade deal with China for the rest of this year. See how that shakes out. The VIX volatility index, as you might expect, quite a spike on that news, hitting 14.17 jumping back to now 1363. We'll jump over to the charts, and before we do, there's the headline. This news breaking just before 1 p.m. Eastern time. Dow drops 250 points on report. A phase one trade deal may not be completed this year. As is the case, folks, we got very few details about when that would be done. The president and his cheerleaders saying it was imminent. Looks like that may not be the case. You can see on the charts when that news break, 1245 on the Dow, we trade 27,825. You touched 27,650 at one point on the Dow. Now just back over that level, 27,704. NASDAQ 100, we trade from a level of 83.29. You go all the way down to 82.32. Quite an acceleration on those charts on the NASDAQ 100. Now trading 82.62. S&P 500, we were trading at 3114. You actually reach a low of 3090. We're now a solid 9 to 10 points back above that level. Crude oil market, quite a day to the upside. Early in the session, trading at 5487. We're now at 5719. There's your gold contract, trading at 1471. You saw gold spike from 1466 up to a level of 1475 on that trade news. And the euro US dollar trading at 11070. What else you had happening? How about the 10-year yield? Now sitting at 1.74%. On the news, you traded from 1.76 to 1.73. And checking in with the two retail giants, Target, separating from the rest, now up 12.7% on the day, and Lowe's beating their earnings as well, up 3.6, but pairing some of those gains. Stay tuned, folks. Live programming for the rest of the day. We'll be right back.